All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, we are playing some Aurelian Soul in the mid lane, and we're running Electrocute, Taste of Blood, Eyeball, Ultimate Hunter, uh, Mana Flow Band, and Transcendence. We're gonna go full AP Aurelian Soul. I'm gonna go Glass Cannon, max damage. Build Pat's probably gonna be a Ludens into Shadow Flame, into Death Cap, into like Horizon. Maybe we might need an Hourglass for against a Talon Viego, but. I'm just gonna try and burst them before they can burst me, because they kind of turned Aurelian Soul into a a bursty mage. This sun is off its axis. It's been and I used to play hit the old soul a ton. When you just level one, you put on your W and just clear the wave and then go roam. Pretty toxic to play against though. All right, we'll start with our W. Uh, this seems like kind of a hard matchup because if I want to go up and hit him, he's gonna be able to hit his W on me too. But, I can always land my stun on him. Nice. Three stars gets us a Electrocute proc. We didn't do that much damage to him, though. He has three potions, too. Okay, his Q's down. All right, not bad. We won that trade. He didn't get his uh, bleed on us because I was able to dodge his W. We need to keep the pressure up, though. I don't want him to use all those potions and heal back to full. But I also need to use mine and heal back to full. Let's see. Guess I'll get my E, just in case we need to get back to lane. All right, he has one potion left. I have none. Nice. Got him to hop over the wall. He can't do that for another minute or two. Nice. Electrocute. That'll probably burn his last potion, so we're dead even now. Mamundo. It'll be very hard for Mundo to gank a Talon. This is a lane I'm going to have to win on my own. Alright, we're going to be maxing W and then Q next. Okay. Didn't get Electrocute there. Oh, I did actually. It's hard to hit him with the W when he jumps on me is what I just learned. But at least they made the change where Soul can activate his Q right in front of him. That allows me to just stun Talon. We've got him in a good spot. Uh, Viego's up top. Heimer might live. Yeah, Heimer lives. Nice, got Electrocute. We're going to be able to push him out of lane, I think. I'm not going to make my W bigger here. Till he runs away. Got him. Got him with that last star. See, if I didn't save my, my W, I don't think we would have had enough damage at the end there. Um, Viego's gonna be coming from top side. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Okay, I live. Okay, that was scary. Let's just get out of here before I die. I thought the tower was gonna shoot me again. <laughs> and I think Talon would have got the kill there, so... Nice, we got the wave in, we're winning in CS, we killed Talon. I've seen enough. Good start. Okay, so we'll just grab Lost Chapter. I'm gonna be very squishy against this guy, so I need to keep up the lead. Stars are not born. They are made by me. Wondering if I should use this to go to lane. I could send a big star at him. Wee. Oh, okay. That was actually really nice. Did half of his health. Yeah, it stuns him for 2.2 seconds there. Alright, we got ult.
I'm gonna keep my distance. I'm actually playing a champ that can follow him bot when he goes to roam. I mean, if he roams and then waits in the bush for me, though, he can kill me. But I have two tools to peel him off me. I have my ult and my Q. He's just got to not get fed enough to be able to one-shot me before I could use those. Mundo wants dragon. I'll give him a ward. Oh, it's a tank, Viego. Oh, no, wait, no. He stole uh, Mundo's items. He doesn't have those. Nice. Okay, the only way he's going to get those three procs on me is if he uses his ult. I should be okay. I'm going to fly away just because of Talon. You can maybe get Viego. Nice. Bursted Talon, Viego dipped out. Good, I stayed in the bush so they would focus Mundo. They wanted to focus him anyway. But really, they needed to go for me first because I'm going to be outputting the damage, not Mundo. We could try for plating, but Talon's going to be right back here quick, so I'm just going to back up. Nice. It's good that we got the early kills. Because this is the only way this build's going to work against this matchup. If you're against a mage or something, it'd be a bit easier. He's missing. Uh oh. I think Samira is going to die. Oh, they might actually be able to kite him. Yeah. Uh. Almost. Let me see if I could get down there. Well, that's not good. The stories they tell about me. I have a feeling by the time I get there, they're going to be gone, yeah. Well, Talon got two assists. At least he didn't get a kill. But Viego probably shouldn't have been able to get those two kills if they just ran. I get my plating. Okay, got him to jump over the wall. Means he loses his farm. Uh, Viego would probably gank from over here. The nice thing is I'm faster than Viego, so if he ganks, I should just be able to stun him and fly away. Unless he just ults on me. Soul's Wave Claire is still very good. I could try and roam top. This guy has no mana. Let's do it. I'm going to save my Q, though. Okay, got his flash. He should die. I don't think I need to use anything. Nice. Okay, Talon is missing. That's a good roam. It's a stack of ultimate, too. As long as Mundo's by me, if Talon's in this bush, I should survive. He moved my mic a little bit closer to my mouth. I mean, at least the Talon's, like, respecting my damage and stuff. He's not just all inning me right away. But I seem to be stronger than him. That combo didn't do that much damage. I'm making a missile out of farm, too. 
Alright, I think he's roaming bot here. Just pinging my bot lane away. Yeah, when you're against champions like this, you really need to make sure... Oh, I'm lagging. You need to make sure you... Oh, shit. You make sure you ping your team. Okay, well, ult him away. I'm gonna flash, just in case, too. Maybe didn't need to flash, but it looks like one auto attack would have proc the bleed, and that would have left me at, like, one health, so... He's got a Yumi on him, too. I don't want to die here. Oh, I got too close. Uh, they might be able to kill him. If he turns into me, he's going to be squishier than his Viego form. The scary thing about this champ is he just keeps killing. He's going to kill all of them. Rip. I got too close. Oh, he's so low, but he's just going to keep healing. <laughs> that champion's so toxic, man. You can never kill him. I, that was my fault, though, for overstaying. I should have just left. It sucks that he has a Yumi on him, too, because it makes him even more unkillable. Oh, is he actually going tank? Can't tell. Oh, well. At least it's not Talon. We could deal with him later, I think. He'll turn into somebody squishy, and then he'll be easy to kill. What happens when you put two 200 years champs together? You get an unkillable Viego because of Yumi. Need to get some vision. Now Talon's got the Yumi. Well, Cho'Gath's going tank. We could kite him pretty well. Yeah, he does have a Sunfire. Interesting. Oh, we could go. Oh, Talon ulted. He's going to start sending this big star up here. Oh, I missed. Missed the cannon, too. Uh, Viego's coming. We should just back up. Uh, don't go this way, dude. Don't go this way. What are you doing? Oh, I'm getting packet loss, unfortunately. Still playable. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Oh my god. Oh, he's faster than me. Are you serious? I don't have boots. Man, I wanted Viego. There we go. We got him. Nice. Darn, I might have to switch back to my old router. Unfortunately, I'm getting packet loss. It, like, lags out for, like, a split second there. Uh, can we get this? I don't think we can. Alright, that was actually a really good fight. I was able to kite them. I'm feeling pretty strong. We got the Viego. That's all I wanted. We need to get that shutdown back from him. Timer doesn't have TP. I stay for this. I got Heimer a cannon. I'm not even recalling where I was. What the hell? Okay, let's do Sork Shoes, but then I can't get a large rod. You know what? We'll just get the alternator. It's actually good that this Viego went tank build, because if he went damage he just kill us instantly he has to do a bit more work now I mean he survives longer but he's still gonna die Senna has 63 stacks that's really good
The way I was moving there, I was moving in the direction of the stars. It actually makes them hit even faster, too. He's going to jump over the wall. And jump over another wall. I think we could take his tower. Diego's bot. Okay, he's got Blade of the Ruin King. So he does damage now. He always did damage. I don't want to go too far up, but we need to get something because we're losing bot. So I guess we'll get Herald and Top Tower too. It's a good trade. No way they get objective bounties right when the turret's about to die. Okay, Talon went Prowlers. That's good. He's going full damage. So, I should be able to one-shot him. But he has a chance of killing me, of course. Wait, on this? Oh, we should not let them have this. It's gone, though. I hit somebody with a Q. I got Yumi. Nice. I sniped her. Ignite Viego so he doesn't heal. Oh, I just stunned Talon when I was, uh, thought I missed it. I'm gonna go look for this guy. Oh, there you are. Taste my stars. Well, they got Dragon Objective, two Objective Bounties, but we're winning fights, so that's good. Ah, they didn't have Cho'Gath there. I think even if he was in that fight, we would have won. Can we get this into the next turret, too? Maybe. Nice. Okay, I think I have Shadow Flame off that. And this item gives me health, so it helps me survive. I could go Horizon next. Or Hourglass. I think I'll just go to death cap though since I'm seven and one. I wouldn't navigate by the stars. They all Their team's not as much of a threat as I thought it'd be. Here comes a big star. They use it to see us. Diego top, I don't have my E to get up there now. Run, Donger, run! Yeah, might as well just stay by your turrets. You're not getting out of there. Not bad. They both have executes. Cho'Gath ate them. So no Cho'Gath ult, but Viego has ult still. He put down turrets in the bush. Uh, Viego is over here. Oh, there's a Yumi, too. Damn, he's full health. Yeah, he's gonna turn. What a disgusting champion. He's faster than me. I couldn't even see the Yumi Q. It was, like, glitching out. <laughs> Man. That champion's so fucking lame to play against. He's so tanky, and he's faster than me, and he does more damage than me. What the fuck? What do we need? Healing reduction? I ignited him, too, though, is the thing. We have healing reduction. Get under the turret. I think she's dead. Oh, Mundo's there. Now she's dead. Oh, wait. It was a bait. He's not gonna die, though. Building Maw, too. Oh, I'm gonna need Magic Pen. Nice! They got him. Okay. I think I'll still get my Death Cap. We'll see, though. I think they win this.
Every time I play against a Viego, it's always like some sweaty platter diamond player playing him. I swear they have inflated elo from him too. The champion is not balanced, because even when I play him, I can get like 20 kills. If you want free low, just play Viego. They have objective bounty again, but the thing is, like, their team getting objective bounty can just spiral them into a big lead. Because they they already have a strong champ. Let's do large rod. Maw's insanely busted this patch, too. We just have to try and take out that guy first or something. Nice, we got his Yumi. That should help us win this fight. They do still have Cho'Gath Smite. Cho'Gath's also going to take a while to die. Nice. Samira's getting her ult off, though. Oh, nice Hourglass by the Donger. Oh, dragon. Viego's still up. Nice, I saved him. This guy's. He died to Mundo. Nice. Thorn mail, baby. I'm gonna chase this guy. I think I can get him. I have alt again. I think it'll disrupt his dash. Nope, it doesn't. There's a Yumi, though. Alright, we got the dragon. That's good. I don't think I can get this. Maybe. Nah. You take their blue. can never have a perfect internet situation. That is the one thing I always struggle with. Like, yeah, this is faster and nicer, but if it, I'm gonna have a little bit of packet loss every game, like, I just might as well switch to the other one that was more stable. Let's see if I could fix it, though. Um, we're fighting here. There's no objective or anything. El Mundo should not recall right in front of a fight. He just kind of killed everybody. Oh, now I'm dead. Eh, they need to run. They're probably all dead, though, because he turns into me. He's even faster. Oh my god, Samira, that was good. Juked him, but I mean, his champion's still way too fast. Even while he's being slowed, he still can beat anybody. That's so lame, man. <laughs> I, I get tilted just from watching this champ. Because, like, he's not outplaying anybody, he's just, like, stat checking them with his fucking broken champ. They need to stop fighting him. Mundo kind of griefed that, though. He literally recalled in front of the whole team fighting. <laughs> How dumb this is. If we don't have the whole team hitting him, he just keeps healing to full. Actually getting 200 years. Like, look at that. Oh, he ulted five times in one fight? Yeah, that's balanced. At least Senna can deal damage to him. Nice. Good play. Okay, I'm gonna try to peel Senna then, because Senna can actually hurt him since he has a Maw and Merc Treads, I do nothing to him. 
But we need to end this game before they outscale us. Somehow they still have objective bounty after we're getting literally run over by one person. We go take this guy out. I'll just go along and cut him off. <laughs> He's too fat to flash over the wall. Let's push bot, I guess. I mean, I hope they're not doing Baron. They could, though. Uh, the Baron might be gone. We don't see any of them on the map. We got played. We shouldn't have went for Cho'Gath, I guess. But we get a bottom, bottom turret. Oh, wait, they're not on it. Hooray. I can't even move that whole time. Yes, I lived. Senna saved my ass. Almost got 200 years. I don't know how he didn't kill me there. Wow, I thought they were on Baron. They're just all farming jungle, I guess. Nice. We should get two inhibs because Viego's a whole team. We kill him. They can't do anything. Oh, he wants to eat me. I'm not getting near him. Oh, I could go by my death cap. Let me go get the death cap. Oh, Jinx apparently AFK'd. She wasn't really doing anything anyway, though. Probably just helped to Diego get more XP. Nice. I'm coming with a big star. Where is he? I'm not gonna make it. Oh, go star, go! Oh, I hit him. That champion. Only when darkness overwhelms the heart will Tarkov realize its folly. Good thing we have a uh, 280 C's bot lane, so when they stacked magic resist, they still take damage. He didn't build a death stance, that's what he needed. If he built a death stance, he'd actually be unkillable. I think last item, I'm gonna go Void, just cause all the MR they have. We have two in him's down, so I don't really need that, uh, Hourglass. My team's got good control of this game. my star. Well, we just need him to not steal the Baron when we do it. How many souls does Senna have? 116. Just need to keep vision up for this dude. Can I hit this over the wall? No. They're not contesting, so we'll just take this Baron. We'll go top now. And we can hopefully end this game out. Looks like they caught him. Nice, Andrew Yumi's dead. Beautiful. Yeah, we we did our job of shutting Talon out of the game. He wasn't able to really roam and do too much. So that's good. This game could have been a lot worse. Where are our minions? I'll go back up Heimer. I want to try and delete Talon. My ult is 765.
All right, nice. GG. If you guys enjoyed... Hang on, I'm bursting him. Oh, that was cool at the end. If you guys enjoyed the soul video, please leave me a like. Also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And last but not least, leave a comment below. Let me know if you think Viego's broken too or not. I really think he's... He does way too much damage for having everything in his kit. Just like every 200 years champ. All right, I'll give it to Senna for the carry. I probably did the most damage, though. Or maybe not. No, I didn't. I did 25k. It's hard to do damage, though. They literally just stacked MR versus me. We did 1,500 on Electrocute, 1,300 Taste. And other than that, I'll see you guys later. Thank you again for watching. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Peace.